wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? And the shot! And that certainly packed a punch. Great leap! Who will be livid with himself? Audrey Thola. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Madrid have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Nagatomo. Well, they've seen lots of the ball. Time to go for it a bit. A bit of creativity and adventure. Forward it goes. Sergio Ramos. So it is still nil-nil. Bale really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Fakuli. Seri. Nagatomo. Barbel looking to get on the end of this. Seri plays it short. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Has a hit! Cleared away. And here's... he's had a go! Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, you strike. Falcao! He's pulled off a fine save. Falcao is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Now it's Benzema. Now it's Bale. Delivers across. That's a corner kick. Barbel attempts a clearance. And here's Bale. Nagatomo plays it forward. Barbel. Barbel.
played into the middle. Just brushed off the ball there. Barbol. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Belanda spreads it towards the left. Can he dig out? Has a hit! The captain scores! Oh, that's very, very well played by the skipper. He was only too aware of the importance of a goal at this late stage in the first half. He knew it would affect the teams. All part of the thought process from someone in his position. Just so calm under pressure. Falcao really showed good strength. And it's half-time here. So there you have it, a close fought half of football. But one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Reflections on the first half. Galatasaray deserved to be ahead, and probably should be in front by more, considering the amount of chances they've managed. Everything points to more of the same second half, and a good solid win. Galatasaray leading 1-0 at the break. Already up and running for the second half. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. He's taking on the lot of them. Oh, the ball's come loose. Bale with an air of confidence about him, a certain swagger. It opened up really nicely when the defence got all tentative then. Uh, they were cautious in making contact, but safe in numbers and it's Azar Mariano gets it back Seri Luyen Dama tries to get it forward quickly and he's made sure that that won't get through Azar just about up to the hour now your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Luyen Dama. Belanda plays it out to the flank. Well positioned to make that interception. It's Falcao! Oh, a very decent attempt. And that's a throw. Casemiro. Madrid are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Well, Cal gets into a dangerous position. Audrey Thola. That's art. Plays it out to the wing. Get that clear. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Bale. Bale's cross. And that's been leave it clear. Beautifully done. And it's Tony Kroos. Belanda battles to win it back. Mariano. They must win all but confirmed. They just need to hold on for a few more minutes. Galatasaray certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. 
hoists it forward. And there goes the final whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. So what do you take away from it?